I'm Brittany Ransom. I'm a professor at CSU Long Beach, and I'm also an artist in residence at the LA Clean Tech Incubator. And today I'm working on a project where I'm 3D scanning logs that have bark beetle damage, and I'm looking to 3D scan them so that I can replicate the paths that they make on and underneath the bark of different trees to recreate sculptures that allow us to look at these pests a little bit differently. Um, so today I'm 3D scanning the tree in sections, um, which will allow me to then take various sections, they come in color, and then attach all of these different sections together and I'll ultimately be able to recreate this entire log uh, as a three-dimensional object. So I'll be able to study these channels and recreate these channels using different materials. Um, so as I do one scan, I have to move the log down to another section. And then mark out the next section that I'm scanning. And then I will go back into the computer and stitch all of these various scans together to recreate the full three-dimensional recreation of the log digital. Since you've been working on this project, have you learned anything new that you didn't think you would learn? I didn't understand how bark beetles, um, how different species of bark beetles essentially like lay eggs in one cluster and then crawl their way out. Um, so it's really interesting to me to look at certain parts of this and see where they've essentially grown and kind of taken over um, this log. I've learned a lot about how these pests are starting to affect uh, the trees in this area in particular um, and how they're affecting trees really all over, it seems like, the western United States and kind of all over the world. Um, so this is my first time really scanning a full log. I've had the opportunity to scan small things, but not anything with this much damage all at once.